Turning now to the Biden presidency, President Joe Biden says there's still a good shot. The Senate will confirm Neera Tandon to head up the Office of Management and Budget. But her nomination is in trouble and may not survive. CBS 4's Madeline Rivera explains why from Capitol Hill. Neera Tandon's nomination to head the Office of Management and Budget has hit a roadblock. Two Senate committees were scheduled to vote on Tandon's nomination today, but both have delayed those votes, a sign she may not have enough support. Vermont Senator Bernie Sanders, who chairs the Senate Budget Committee, and Arizona Senator Kirsten Sinema, who sits on the Homeland Security Committee, have both refused to say whether they support Tandon's nomination. She has little chance of making out of the committees without their votes. They put out the a statement from the leadership of the committee conveying clearly that uh, they wanted to continue to do work to build support for her nomination. The White House says it will try to address any concerns and will stand by the nominee. There's one nominee to lead the budget department. Her name's Neera Tandon, and that's who we're continuing to fight for. Tandon's confirmation is faltering because of past tweets slamming several politicians, including Senator Sanders, while most of her sharper tweets were aimed at Republicans. You wrote that Susan Collins is quote, the worst, that Ted, Tom Cotton is a fraud, that vampires have more heart than Ted Cruz. Uh, you called Leader McConnell, Moscow Mitch, and Voldemort. Tannen apologized for those tweets during her confirmation hearings. I recognize that this role is a bipartisan role, and I know I have to earn the trust of senators across the board. But it wasn't enough to win over Democratic Senator Joe Manchin, who said he didn't believe she would be able to work with Republicans to get legislation through Congress. Madeline Rivera, CBS News, Capitol Hill.